This video is brought to you today by Ghost Tags. This is my own company that I started because I wanted a glow in the dark air tag case. These things are awesome. You can stick them on your backpack, on your dog's collar, and you will be able to find it at night. We've got two colors, blue and green. They've got great reviews. Go check them out. Links to them down below. Now on to the video. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Slim and you're watching Slimothy TV. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get dark mode on any website in Safari on your iPhone. So uh, I pulled up Mac Rumors here and you can see it is in dark mode. Any website that I open will be in dark mode. The way to do this is very simple. All you'll need to do this is just an application called Noir. So I've got mine filed away deep inside my utilities folder because I really don't ever need to open it, but here it is, Noir. And as you can see, there's not a whole lot of settings in here. Uh, it's pretty basic. You just got auto on or off. So I've got mine set to auto. So when my phone is in dark mode, it will automatically make every website dark mode, which is awesome. So currently I have the theme set to dark, but you also have black, gray, and sepia there. So you can pick whichever you like. And that's it. If you find a website that doesn't quite work right, you can add it to the uh, whitelist here and it will not make it dark. And then if you go over here to themes, you can actually edit these just a bit. So if I go to dark mode here, you can see I can change the brightness, the background color, the text color, pretty much everything about this theme I can change. I can also share the theme if I edit it and I want to send it to someone else. Super cool stuff here. This app is definitely worth the price if you like dark mode. Uh, it's seriously made Safari so much better for me. Over here in the more settings, you can sync it. So syncing it to iCloud, that way it'll go to all your devices. And honestly, that's it. You just download the app, enable it, and you're good to go. So I highly recommend checking out Noir. It is by far one of the best tweaks that you can do to your enhance your Safari experience. You can also create new themes, of course, and there's also a theme library. So if any of these look great to you, you can go ahead and install them free of charge, of course. So you just click the little plus and you're done. So let's show you an example. I went to this absolute garbage website, CNN, and then I'm gonna hop back into Noir Noir, and we are on the dark theme, but let's go ahead and change it to forest. Let's go ahead and set that as the default theme here. And we'll go back to CNN, refresh the page. And now everything is with that green theme. So of course this looks, you know, better or worse on different websites. Um, but obviously this website is absolute garbage. Maybe changing the theme makes it a little bit more tolerable and eh, probably not for CNN. Anyways, I'm going to set it as the default theme back to dark because that is my absolute favorite. Uh, it makes reading things on the web so much easier, just having it in dark mode. Uh, it's so much easier on the eyes. So check out Noir. Again, it's like $3.99 in the App Store. It might've gone down, might've gone up. Links down below if you wanna check it out. Anyways, if you like the video, hit the big thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.